welcome back children so in the previous class we saw a new story what is the name of the story yes divya and her family you all like the story yesterday do you all see that video very good children so we are going to recollect the story divya and her family shall we ready so i am going to read the sentence you repeat with me divya lives with her parents her brother arun and kukki kukki is their pet dog next salma lives with her mother david lives with his grandparents they all live with their family divya and her family move to a new house divya wants her friends to see her new house she wants her friends to come and play with her divya's friends come home for play time divya is excited to show her friends her new home so up to this we have seen yesterday right did you feel easy to read this story okay if you have any difficult words you can see the video and then make sure with the difficult words once again i'll give you new words from the story we recollected okay kanna let us begin first grandfather grandmother father i'll give you underline and show wait first grandfather grandmother father mother brother sister uncle aunt cousin do you remember cousin what what is cousin yes a son or a daughter for an uncle or aunt next word excited excited means what i say yes very happy next members play time parent so you have to see this new words once again grandfather grandmother father mother brother sister uncle aunt cousin excited members play time parents understand next you can take your little thing little thinker page number 3 as yes, i'll wait for 2 minutes you will you can take your little thinker book page number 3 okay children now i will read the title you follow with me circle the following words in the grid so you all know about 
the names of your family members right so that has been given in this grid but you have to find the word which has been given in vertical or in horizontal way you have to find those words and then you can make a circle over it shall i try one one more one word for you okay children i'll try g r a n d m a what is this whether they have given this word in the clue box i found it yes grandma see wait i'll underline and show yes grandma the word given is g sorry children let us erase okay see the letter g r a n d m a yes you can circle the word grandma like this each and every word given in the clue box you have to find from this grid and circle it i'll give you time later after this video you can continue and then complete this activity 2.2 okay children let me move to the next continuation of the story shall we okay what happened in the previous class divya's friends came to their house no so what divya is doing doing with them shall we see okay divya shows her friends the living room yes what is mean by living room yes hall you all are having in your house right the living room is the front place in your house okay so you can take rest and you can watch video watch television and then you can play in your living room so this is the living room for divya she is showing that to her friends okay once again i'll read this sentence for you divya shows her friends the living room next she takes them to the dining room yes it seems to be like dining room no so you can watch the picture there chair dining table some vessels to use it in the dining and then near to the cupboard what is there yes a fridge so these are all the things that should be in dining room okay so what we are going to do in this dining room what activity we will do in this room yes definitely we are going to eat in this dining room shall we go and eat with divya okay 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 so i'll read the sentence divya shows her friends the dining room next what room is this yes this is kitchen okay divya shows them the kitchen shanti is helping amma who is shanti yes the blue color sari is shanti she is a helper she is helping mamma to make what she is having in her hand yes samosa so divya shows them the kitchen shanti is helping amma make samosa so what mummy is preparing here samosas for whom yes for her friends she is preparing yummy yummy delicious samosas so what daddy is doing there i think he is cutting or chopping some vegetables i think so 
Yes, they are also watching, no? Okay. Next. What room is this? It looks like. Yes, Divya's new room. New room. So, she is having a big doll. And the walls are designed, no? Designed with moon and stars, right? So, they are excited to see her new room. They like this room. Divya is, read with me, Divya is excited to show her friends her new room. Divya is proud of her room. Very good. Next. See the remaining part. The walls are yellow. What color the walls are? This is the wall. What color it is? What color? What color it is? Yellow. Very good. The walls are yellow. The curtains are violet. I will show you the curtains. Wait. The curtains are violet. Divya has toy cars. Okay. And dolls of all sizes. See, look at the picture. Many dolls she is having inside her room. And she is arranging it. Because they are entering into the house right now. No. So, she is arranging the room. Next. See, I, I tell you, no. The curtains are what color? Yes, it is violet in color. Next. She has building blocks. Big and small. You like to play with building blocks, right? So, it is big and small. Next. She has story books. Did you find any books over there in the room? I too saw that. Very good. This is a small cupboard. Inside many books are there. No. So you love to read books? Very good. You also make a cupboard and keep many books to read. That is useful for you. She has story books full of color and beautiful pictures. Yes, I too like storybooks with beautiful pictures and colors, right? So, she is also in the same way. She is having many books in her cupboard. Next, up to this, we stop. Okay, so we saw, what are the rooms we saw in her house? Shall we go through once again? First, what room is this? Yes, it is living room. What are the pillows kept over the sofa? It is, what, what is, what is the color of the pillows? Yes, yellow and green. And a picture of Ganapati is on the wall. Very good. Some fish pot is also there in the living room. A small desk, uh, newspaper on it. So, these are the things kept in the living room. Next to what room we saw? What room is this? Is this a kitchen? No. What room is this? Yes, this is dining room. Next. What room is this? This is? Very good. It is kitchen. Next. This is? Yes, Divya's new room. Bedroom it is. Okay. Next, same bedroom. So, we have see the types of room in the story. Right? So, you see this picture. Take your little thinker book, page number 4. And look at the pictures given in the book. Have you all taken? Okay, see. Look at the picture, picture and name the room. So, now I don't tell you anything. You have to write the names of the rooms. 
shown in the picture. See, first picture. What room is this? Very good. This is kitchen. You have to find the word kitchen from the storybook and then write it here. Next, second picture. One man is lying down on the bed. So, what room is this? This is See, what room is this? Yes, this is bedroom. Next, you can write the name bedroom in this given area. Next, the boy is brushing his teeth. What room is this? Yes, this is washroom or bathroom. Okay. So, you can write the word bathroom in the given area. Next, what is this area called? There are chairs, some vessels and they are eating in the food that are kept in the table. So, what room it is? Yes, this is dining room. Very good children. Next picture. A family is sitting in the sofa and they are washing something. So, what room it is? Where the sofa will be? Yes, this is living room. You can write in this given area. Okay, I will give you time. You can watch this video and then you complete this activity. Kana. Shall we move to the next one? Okay. So, this is very, very easy. I am going to read and tell you what it is. Write one activity that you cannot be done in these rooms. Okay. Write one activity. What is the activity which should be done in the room? First, see the first picture. This is what room is this? Yes, this is dining area. So, what we cannot be done in these rooms. So, they are given cannot. So, which activity we should not do in this room? Shall we play in this room? No. Shall we take bath in this room? No. So, what we have to do in this room? We have to eat in this particular room, dining room. What we have to do? We have to do only eating. So, what they are asking means one activity that cannot, see the word cannot be done here. So, you have to write that. You cannot take bath. So, you can write that. You cannot um, sleep in this room. You can write that like that. You have to do the activity one by one. See the picture and then you can write one or two activities which cannot be done in this room. Understand children? Shall I go to the next one and explain you? To make yourself clear. So, I will see. I'll show the picture of the second one. What room is this? Yes, this is bathroom. One activity that cannot be done here. So, what should we should not do in this room? Sleeping, eating. Very good. You can write that what you have said. Next. See the picture. What room is this? This is? Yes, this is bedroom. So, what we should not do in this room? We should not eat in this room and we should not Play in this room. Very good. You can write whatever you say. You can write here. So, see the word cannot and write here. Okay, children. If you don't understand means you can see the video once again to make clear idea. Shall we go to the next one? I am going to continue the story. Are you all ready? Yes. Very good.
before going to the next sto next one we can recollect the story once again okay children i'll tell you divya shows her friends the living room divya shows her friends the dining room divya shows them the kitchen shanti is helping amma make samosas divya is excited to show her friends her new room divya is proud of her room the walls are yellow the curtains are violet divya has toy cars and dolls of all sizes she has building blocks big and small she has story books full of color and beautiful pictures so you have to complete this 2.3 activity and 2.4 activity i have explained you if you have any doubts you can go through this video one second kana shall we go to the story yes we are going to end the story listen it carefully arun who is arun yes divya's brother arun wants to show them his favorite place in the in his new home the garden it is a beautiful garden see the picture of the garden how it is it looks very beautiful no so with many flowers uh, mango trees there see how many mangoes are there no yes there are mangoes on the tree next uh, there are mangoes on the ground do you find any mangoes in the previous picture yes there are mangoes on the ground there are mangoes everywhere see divya is also a mango in her hand there is also a little house for the family pet so do you see any little house here in the picture yes for whom this house is yes the family pet what is the name of this pet cookie Shall you all call Cookie to come inside the home? Cookie, yes. So now Cookie is going to come to his house. Very good. So Divya, Arun, David, Salma, and Cookie play hide and seek. Oh, they are playing here in the garden. Very good. What game is that? Hide and seek. So who is hiding here? See, Divya is hiding behind Cookie's house, and then their friends are also hiding somewhere. Do you find their friends? Very good. And one more is hiding somewhere. Do you find who is that? Yes, Cookie is also hiding inside the house. Very good. No. So they are hide, playing hide and seek very happily in the garden. So we are all going to be silent to find them. Shh. Very good, Kanna. So this is the end of the story. Do you all like the story? Okay, children. We will see tomorrow. Thank you.